At the end of the last century, the American inventor Hiram Maxim presented himself to the police in Petersburg, Russia. He was there to sell his new Maxim machine gun to the Tsar. Your name is Hiram. You're Jewish, said the officer. I am not. My people were Puritans, said Maxim. Then what is your religion? I never had need of one, Maxim snorted. Well, no one can stay in Russia without a religion. Very well, Maxim replied, put me down as a Protestant. And that, he tells us, is how I became a Protestant. Now a Protestant, Maxim went on to become a Sunday school teacher. But meanwhile, he sold vast numbers of his guns to Russia. Russia soon went to war with Japan, and Maxim proudly tells us, more than half the Japanese killed in the late war were killed with the little Maxim gun. Maxim was born in Maine in 1840. He was drawn to invention early in life. He worked with gas illumination, then electricity. He developed electric lighting systems even before Edison. In 1883, a friend told him, hang your electricity. If you want to make your fortune, invent something to help these fool Europeans kill each other more quickly. Maxim took the advice. By 1885, he'd invented the first single barrel machine gun. This Maxim gun fired 666 rounds a minute and it changed warfare. The Russo-Japanese War was a storm warning of the slaughter we'd see a decade later in World War I. The Maxim guns and nastier guns that followed made Maxim's name. They also gained him an English knighthood. By then he was an English citizen and a friend of royalty.